Hey what's going on everybody, this is Dom, and today we are performing a Geekbench test here on the iPhone 5S. So, as you can see, I have Geekbench already loaded up, and we are ready to get started with the test here. So let's go ahead and open it up. As you can see here, we do have some details listed about the iPhone 5S and our processor information along with the memory information. So we're going to go ahead and benchmark this guy right here and see how it performs. Now all we have to do to start the test is tap on Run Processor Benchmark, and we are up and running. Now, I'm going to fast forward through this a little bit so you guys don't have to sit here through the entire process, but I expect this obviously to outperform the iPhone 5. So we're just about finished up here, and as you can see, we have a single core score of 1394 and a multi-core score of 2506. Now compared to the iPhone 5 here, that's double the processor speed obviously, and I expected that much from the 5S because it is expected to be a lot faster than the iPhone 5. So as you can see right there, there's a little comparison in case you wanted it. But I will also go ahead and upload these scores here for you. So if you want to check them out, I'll be sure to leave the link down below in the description for you. So you can go ahead and check out all of the details here with this benchmark score. And we can just hit the upload button right there and upload it to the Geekbench website. And as I said, just check the link down below in the description if you want to see the full rundown on this benchmark. I will be sure to leave that link for you down there. So just wanted to give you a quick little benchmark test on the iPhone 5S and compare it to the iPhone 5 in case anybody was curious. I'm definitely not surprised by these results, but let me know what you think down in the comments section below. Thanks again for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. This is Dom, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode.